out here in Vernal, Utah, documenting historic markers and monuments. If the gable end of old hell would blow out, it wouldn't melt the snow in six months, exclaimed a frustrated and tired U.S. mail contractor who was late with his deliveries during the hard winter of 1879. His was the disagreeable job of hauling mail on horseback 120 miles north to Rock Springs, Wyoming, over rugged and wind-whipped mountains through the worst winter in the Uinta Basin's history. In the winter of 1877, Alfred Harvey Westover made the trip to Rock Springs on snowshoes with sacks of letters, for which he was paid 25 cents per letter. Even though snow blinded during one storm, he still persevered. The Vernal Post Office was established in 1886 and was moved in 1920 to the White Sandstone Corner building directly across the street. For 66 years, it served as the U.S. Post Office and notably was the only federal building authorized for an inland town in the United States and the first ever constructed off of a railroad line.